Yo, what is going on everyone? It is Memory here. I told you guys I had some more vivid voltage coming your guys' way. And as you can see right here, we're going to be cracking into a booster box, 36 packs. We had the Elite Trainer box, which, you know, we have the sleeves. We are going to be using the sleeves. Uh, in this opening, which is actually going to be really cool. We got those from the Elite Trainer Box, but that one was only 8 packs. There's 36 packs in here, so we have a lot of Vivid Voltage to get into in this video. And like I told you guys, with this video, with the Booster Box, you're going to see uh, more so of the, the wide scope of you know Vivid Voltage. Because with the Elite Trainer Box, you can only, you know, there's only 8 packs in it. There's no promo with it. I mean, the box and all of that is nice. The card sleeves, and there are some other little cool things that you get in there. But this is where you really get a good look at you know the cards inside the set which so far actually besides this video I've opened up two boxes already because I did two on stream and we actually have only pulled one Pikachu card and it was the Pikachu V uh, not the full art or anything like that not the rainbow not the V max we haven't pulled any Pikachus besides that one so are we gonna get I'm hoping we get uh, you know the full art would be awesome obviously one of the chubby chews the rainbow one is the one that everybody wants um, so we'll see we'll see will I have uh, better luck with this one than my other two boxes that I didn't open up in video format we'll see uh, but we're gonna crack right into it but uh, just I, just in case you you guys are new i do want to kind of show off uh the box as you can see right here it's really nice uh how they and this is how all the booster boxes are like how they set them up this art all around as you can see celebi there and this on this side they have orbital so and if i'm looking over here if you guys see me looking over here i'm just making sure everything's good on obs because like i said a lot of this is a work in progress um so yeah we're gonna crack right on open we're starting right off with pikachu pack arts too so we're gonna crack right open our booster box of vivid voltage should i get out all the packs i don't know if i maybe I, should i get all the packs i'm not we're just gonna we're just gonna go with it we're just gonna go with it and i'm gonna try and be a lot faster than i was um with the elite trainer box because i was honestly like kind of going slow in that because it was only like eight packs but uh booster box openings can take like a lot longer so uh yeah we're gonna hop right into this opening can we get some first pack magic we're starting off here with galvantula swellow wash energy eevee Woobat, aracuda c dot banfi the reverse execute and first pack magic we got a pikachu v first pack magic this is the card i was actually just talking about i said this is the only pikachu card that i've got so far with vivid voltage so i guess we're continuing on that trend i now have two of those so we're going to get that in the sleeve real quick as you can see right here pikachu v and we're of course using the vivid voltage sleeve so very nice we're starting off with a pool so you can't really complain about that honestly i'm gonna get this off frame um so yeah let's see that's another thing i gotta get better with is like them is managing uh you know where i put everything you know so we're gonna do the left side first of the box because there's 18 packs 18 packs we're gonna do the left side and then we'll do the right side that's how i'm gonna do it um with this one so let's get into the next pack ladies and gentlemen and even with the green code cards you can like i talked about in the elite trainer box opening you still can get a lot of good cards uh, like you can get like leon's charizard in the reverse slot obviously you can get the amazing rares which they say there's two amazing rares in each box so that's actually really really good because i like the amazing rares i think that's an awesome thing that they've added for sure so we got leaf energy beauty shuckle nuzleaf mudbray joltic if you guys watch the elite trainer box opening some of these cards are gonna look familiar there's gonna be a new card you haven't saw uh, as well, we got Talo, Sandile, Reverse Wind and Stadium, and a Shift Tree. So nothing from that one. What do you guys think of Shift Tree? I feel like Shift Tree is like, it's not like a super crazy like Pokemon or anything like that. But like I've told you guys before, I really like, um, you know, Gen 3. So I kind of have a sp uh, soft spot for a lot of those Pokemon so, which I'm not like a huge, huge fan of Shift Tree, but I, Shift Tree's all right. Shift Tree's all right. I wonder if there's any like, I feel like there's like, there might be, I, I, I would imagine there is like someone out there, but I was going to say like, I feel like there's not, there's not probably a super fan of Shift Tree out there, but there probably is. I mean, there's so many Pokemon fans, so there's probably someone who's just, you know, 
crazy over shift tree. And there's nothing wrong with that. Dustclops, Rocky Helmet, Whalmer, Cottony, Clobopus, Electrike, Execute, Reverse Tynamo, and we got Garbodor. In my opinion, just one of the dumbest Pokemon, and, and just for the name and for the look. Like, I, I, to be completely honest, you know, I'm sorry if you like Garbodor, but I mean, my goodness. <laughs> my goodness. Hopping into the next pack. Let's see what we got here. And I, I've like I've been noticing a trend with I mean it's not as it doesn't seem as bad, but in, in like my the first one I opened, I think it might have been from the Elite Trainer box. It was the Elite Trainer box. Yeah, there was like whitening on the on the cards, um, on some of them, which I was like, what is going on here? But hopefully we don't have that problem with this one. Dust clops, Pharaoh Seed. It could be something with like the shipping, like how it came in, or just you know, there's there's a bunch of factors that could play into that. Sandile, C Dot, Picky Peck, Reverse, Mudbray, and Manetric. And like I told you guys before, I really like the Manetric art. Uh, definitely. For, even though it's just a regular, it's not like a hollow or anything like that. I, I do like the art a lot from that Manetric. Next pack, this one's kind of glued weird on the seal, I gotta say. It's kind of odd. All right, next pack. We got Fire Energy. Maybe we get a hollow Zard here. Loudred, Memory Capsule, Go Goat, The Goat, Milsery, Whoopa, Inkata, Wismer, Drillbur. Ooh, Reverse Hollow Dialga. I know there's, I have the Hollow Dialga. I have not got the Reverse. And we got uh, the Hollow, I don't even. Magirna, Magirna, yeah, that's how you say it. So we got the Hollow Magirna. Uh, honestly, don't know much about the Pokemon because, like I've told you guys before, in the past, like some of the newer gens, besides like you know Sword and Shield, like the most recent stuff before that, really, I really stopped playing Pokemon. Or it was really stopped following it after Diamond and Pearl, after that gen. Uh, so after that, like I'm trying to get back into those games I missed now. But I really fell off at one point with Pokemon. Uh, it was like after that gen, after Sinnoh. All right, next pack. We're moving on here. Oops. We got Excadrill, Macargo, Nessa, Execute, Chatot, Clobopus, Skiddo, Shuppet, Reverse Genesect, and we got the Fortress. All right, so the left side hasn't really gave us too much. Uh, we haven't got too much luck on the left side so far, honestly, I got to say. But we're moving on. Oops. We're moving on. I need to get a bigger desk. That's one thing I need. I was going to get one from Ikea, but, I mean, the shipping, like the shipping times and because of the whole COVID thing and all that, yeah. Metal Energy, Aromatic Energy, Mighty Enna, Pinchur, Pinchurchin, Galarian Meowth, Chimeco, Blitzel, Slugma, Beldum, Reverse Moo Moo Cheese, and a Mudsdale. So they say, yeah, they say you get two amazing rares in every box, and I thought, because the second, yeah, the second box, or no, that was the first box I opened, so I had three boxes total. In the first box I opened, I didn't get my second Amazing Rare to the second to last pack. So I was kind of worried. I was like, am I going to be the outlier? Am I going to be the one who actually doesn't get two Amazing Rares in the box? But I think it's like pretty much guaranteed you get two uh, in a box. At least from everyone I have saw that's opened boxes already. Moving on, we have Water Energy, Cramorant, Drone Rodham, Swoobat, Weedle, Drillbur, the Fairy, Wilmer, Tynamo, Reverse Hollow Manetric. So I don't think I have this one yet. And I was saying how much I like the art on this Manetric. So it's cool we have the Reverse. And we got a Ninjask. The left side has not really been friendly to us, everyone. <laughs> got the Pikachu art. Got the Pikachu art here. Can our luck... Uh, oops. Let me be careful. Can our luck shift... Right here. 
and a white code, so it's possible. And it's the Pikachu art. Mm. Here we go. Electric, Delmize, Galarian Stungfisk, Oshawott, Pinaco, Clefairy, Dynamo, Milsery, the Reverse Nincata, and we got the Hollow Genesect, which I already have a couple of those, <laughs> to be honest. Um, not one of my favorite hollows, honestly, in the set. Like, I like the Hollow Lugia, the Hollow Zard. Obviously, I haven't got the Hollow Zard yet, or the Hollow Lugia, but I like those. Uh, definitely the Hollow Dialga, even. Um, I like the Regirock, even though the Regirock's not really, like, super valuable or anything like that. I do like that one. The seals on some of these packs is just, like, really weird to me. All right. Four cards. Let me get our first. We still haven't got our first Amazing Rare. Still haven't got our first Amazing Rare. Dustclops, Rocky Helmet, Galvantula, Eevee, Woobat, Aracuda, Z Dot, Manfee, Reverse Z Dot, and Lucario. And I really like this Lucario art. The Luca yeah, this Lucario art is sick. I wish it was a Hollow, but I mean, I'll take this. We did have a Lucario. I think it was Lucario V in Champions Path. I would have loved to have another like V card or something like that of Lucario in here, but still they're somewhat showing Lucario some love, so I wish it would have been a hollow, but it's whatever. It's whatever. <laughs> Alright. So still continuing on this trend of the left side of the box just not being real real kind to us. Duat, Ferrothorn. Careless. Careless. Trub trubbish. <laughs> careless. Memories being careless. Dynamo. Clobopus. Woobat. Talo. Reverse Samurai. I don't think I've got one of these yet. And a Beedrill. Got a lot of Beedrill. It wouldn't be a vivid voltage opening without Beedrill. It would not. <laughs> oh, man. I'm just waiting for our luck. I'm waiting for our luck to, to turn. The right side of the, the box must be stacked or something. Or it's just like the last couple packs in this left side are just crazy. We'll see, though. All right. I, I think I saw something. Hold up. Leaf Energy Memory Capsule. Shout out to Memory. Go Goat. The Goat. Ferrothorn. Wilmer. Cottony. Clobopus, Electrike, Execute, Reverse Bea, and we got Colossal VMAX. And I do not have Colossal VMAX yet. I have a bunch of Colossal Vs, uh, but we got Colossal VMAX for our second hit uh, in this Vivid Voltage Booster Box opening, which that's an actual, that's a pretty cool one, I gotta say. I'm not like super big on Colossal, to be honest, but I will take that. For sure. There we go. We got Colossal. Colossal VMAX. I just like showing off the sleeve. <laughs> I like showing off the sleeves. They're, they're so awesome. It's like one of the main reasons why I'm so happy I got the Elite Trader Box. Because, I mean, I just love the sleeves. Alright. Moving on. So, there's a hit. There's a hit. Can we get two in a row? Can we get two in a row, though? That's the... Can we get an amazing rare here? All right. We got Electric Energy, Bea, Drafferig, Moo Moo Cheese, Chimeco, Ninkata, Voltorb, Rockruff, Wismer. Ooh, we got Rayquaza. We got the amazing rare. I was just saying I need. We Are we going to get the amazing rare? Here we go. We got Rayquaza, baby. I think this is like, Rayquaza has to be the most common amazing rare you can pull. I mean, it might be, uh, I don't know, Zacian or, or Zamazenta might be up there. But this I think this is the third Rayquaza I've got for the amazing rares. So we got our first amazing rare. Look at that. Just a, such a beautiful card. Such a beautiful card. And then we got uh, the Manetric for the last one. Poor Manetric just got totally overshadowed by our amazing rare <laughs> Rayquaza. 
I, I there's only like I need the Raikou still. As you can see right here. Such a beautiful card, man. I still need the Raikou. I still need the Jirachi. I have pulled the Celebi. Um, I need Zamazenta. So I've almost I think I've pulled half. I think I've pulled half the amazing rares. So far. But I have like three Rayquazas. I have like three amazing rare Rayquazas, man. I'm not complaining because I love Rayquaza, but dang. That's two in a row. That's two in a row. Our luck is kind of starting to change with the second, uh, the left, left half. Excuse me. Bumble in the bag there. <laughs> Fighting Energy, Mighty Anna, Pinchurchin, Loudred, Milsery, Wooper, Ninkata, Wismer, Drillber, Reverse Fortress, and Lycanroc. All right, so we got three more packs, or we might, yeah, we might have four. We, I think we have four more packs on the left side. So we're moving along. Definitely going a lot quicker than I was in the, uh, I know I like to ramble and go on tangents sometimes and whatnot, but I think we're definitely making better progress than we did in the Elite Trainer Box, like how slow we were going. All right. Sorry, you saw the yes, you saw the Yanma. You know one of the cards in here already. <laughs> All right, we got Fire Energy Nessa. Give me the full art Nessa or the rainbow one, man. Excadrill Yanma, Wooper, Dedene, Picky Peck, Riolu, Mighty Anna, and we got Orbital V. I don't have this one yet. I have Orbital V Max. I have not pulled Orbital V. So we got Orbeetle V here. Not really a big fan of Orbeetle, to be honest. But I do not have this one yet. So I will take it. I will definitely take it. Not the full art really I wanted, but we'll take it. Orbeetle V, as you can see there. So yeah, our luck is actually start we're starting to get hits. We're starting to get hits. The left side was kind of letting us down. Definitely uh, at the start. I mean, we started off good. We started off with the Pikachu V, and then it just was dud after dud. But can we keep it up? Because that's like, what, two or three hits, like in the last three or four packs? All right. Next one. Delmize. Galarian Stungfisk. Aromatic Energy. Galarian Meowth. Chimeco. Litzel. Slugma. Beldum. Reverse Hollow Galvantula, and we got the Hollow Leon. I think uh, during this turn, your Pokemon's attack do 30 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon. I think the other Leon card does some like crazy thing with Charizard, like if you pair it up with Charizard, which makes sense. Um, but I would love to have that card, the Nessa or the Leon, like the full arts from them, or the rainbow ones. Obviously, I would love to have, or even Bea, like Bea would be really cool. Because I think I got Alistair already, and I got Opal. Not the rainbow ones, but the full arts. All right. Moving on. We're almost done with the left side of the box here. We got Metal Energy, Charmeleon. Haven't got one of those yet in this box. Trumbeak, Shuppet, Uchiana, Voltorb, Rockruff, Taylo, Reverse Hollow Beauty, and we got Toucan Sam, the legend itself, himself. Could be a girl, I guess, as well. But Toucan Sam. All right, this is the last pack. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore, but this is the last pack. Not of the, of the box, but on the left side. Can we leave off the left side with a bang? We've still only got one Pikachu in three boxes, and it's been the Pikachu V. The, like the most basic one <laughs> memory capsule shout out to memory could they be blessing me with this one I don't know electric Oshawott Pinaco Clefairy Tynamo Milsery Puchiana and we got Alistair rainbow rare I got the I was just saying I got the full art the regular one now we got the rainbow rare full art the secret rare Man, that is a beautiful card. That is nice. 
Wow, 192 out of 185. Got to be real careful, uh, careful with this. Going to put it right in the sleeve for sure. The centering on it actually looks pretty good from what I can see. Man, look at that. We got Alistair. I got two Alistairs now. Uh, this is my first time getting the rainbow one, though. That is nice. That is very nice. Woo! I'm happy about that. So we left off the left side. The left side kind of let us down for most of the most of the time, but uh, le the left side left off on a, uh, on a good mark. That's that's for sure. So now we're moving on to the right side of the box. We got 16 more packs, or no, 18. I can't do math. I might have said 16 earlier, so you guys are probably are, have already made fun of me if I didn't say 16. And I said 18, then I'm just I just got short-term memory loss, and my name's Memory. Don't forget it. All right, we got Fire Energy, Crocorock, oh, Crocorock, Aromatic Energy, Galvantula, Joltik, Sandile, C Dot, Picky Peck, Mudray, Reverse Lycanroc, and we got Whimsicott. So starting off the right side with a stinker. Moving on. I want to see how much that Alistair real quick is actually going for. Around fifteen to twenty dollars, it looks like right now. That's without getting it graded, so that's that's actually pretty good. So, I'm actually really happy about that. It's not the Nessa or the Leon, but hey, we'll take it. We'll definitely take it. Still haven't got our second amazing rare yet either. So, look forward to probably another one of those, unless, like I said, I'm I might be the outlier, like I almost was before. Delmise, Trumbeak, Sableye. Skiddo, Eevee, Trubbish, Shuppet, Choodle, Reverse Hollow Hitman Top, Hitmon Top, excuse me, and Vaporeon. I love the art on this Vaporeon. This Vaporeon is gorgeous. I've said that before, I think. But definitely a beautiful card. Not a not a hollow or anything, but very beautiful. Alright. Moving on to the next pack. Gotta be careful there. Careful, Nate. All right, we got Metal Energy, Swoobat, swooping in, Macargo, League Staff, Chatot, Clobopus, Skiddo, Shuppet, Ferroseed, Reverse Hollow, Surchester Bath, and we got a Don Fan. One of the OG, one of the OGs, I'd say. One of the OGs. Not like super OG, but Don Fan's pretty old. Don Fan is pretty old. All right. Moving on. We're winding down here. I want to know what is your guys' favorite card if you guys are keeping up with Vivid Voltage? Like, what is your favorite card? Maybe in terms of look, and then if you guys play competitively, what is your favorite card to use for competitive? Let me know down in the comments. Water Energy, Galarian Stungfisk, Coating Energy, Shuckle, Execute, Woobat, Beldum. Beldum didn't want to go there for a second. Blitzel, Milsery, Reverse Hollow Trubbish, and we got Orbital V Max. So I was saying I had one of these uh, earlier. So we got the Orbital V, Orbital V Max. Literally looks like a, I don't know, is it like a giant hotel giant spaceship i don't what do you guys think i think it's like a combination of like some kind of crazy futuristic like hotel but it's also a spaceship at the same time isn't that something that's kind of crazy so we got the orbital v max in the sleeve i like the art on the orbital i'm just not really like i don't know i'm just not really a big fan not really a big fan honestly i may it might be good for competitive it might I, i'm not really sure but Honestly, I, I'm just not a big fan of the look of the Pokemon. Uh, honestly, that's just me, though. This one's being a little... Kind of fighting with me. <laughs> kind of fighting with me a little bit. Alright. Might have messed up there. I'm not really sure. We're good, though. Should be good. Wash Energy. Surchester Bath. Hitman Top. Drillbur. Clefairy. Whalmer. Tynamo, Execute, Reverse Delmise, 
And we got another Lucario. Hey, I don't mind looking at this Lucario, honestly. It may not be worth anything, but this is one I definitely am keeping just for my yo, personal collection. Like, honestly, like, I know I've pulled a couple of them already, but I just love the art on it so much. And I love Lucario. Who doesn't love Lucario? I feel like probably almost everyone likes Lucario. But hey, there could be some Lucario haters out there. They're like, screw Lucario. <laughs> All right. Sure, I'm careful here. Leaf Energy, Cramorant, Hakuna, Surchester Bath, Joltik, Cottony, Mudbray, Slugma, Wismer, Reverse Hollow Drone Rodham, and we got the Hollow Tornadus. Hollow Tornadus. What do you guys think of this one? I think this one's all right. I would have preferred like a Hollow Lugia, uh, or not Hollow Lugia, Lucario or Vaporeon or something like that. But Tornado, Tornadus is pretty cool. Hey, we got a fan fee. I saw you, fan fee. All right. I know. I I think I always do that. All right. All right. Cramorant, Nessa, Nuzleaf, fan fee. Is that, I just noticed that. Yeah, the fan fees like with the Teddy Ursa. Aw. Yanma. Galarian Meowth. Duskull. Weedle. Reverse Whoopa. And we got a Ninjask. Still haven't got a Charizard yet either. I'm kind of surprised, honestly, by that. I haven't got... I've got three reverse Charizards, Leon's Charizards. And I have one regular one. I have not got the Hollow yet. I don't know what the pull rate is for the Hollow Charizard, honestly. Uh, it might be... Probably more, it's, it's probably harder to get than the reverses or obviously like the regular one. I would love to get one of those. Because then I'd have all of them. I'd have the complete like set from here. Fighting Energy, Heroes Metal, Galarian Stunfisk, Sableye, Pinaco, Mudbray, Uchiana, Charmander. First Charmander we've got from this box. Chatot. Reverse Matang and Electros. Man, this uh, th this side's kind of oh, I mean, besides the Alistair, I mean, we've got hits on the right side. I would say the right side so far has probably been better than the left, but we've kind of hit a dry spell again, sort of like how we did with the left side, you know. So maybe these last couple packs we leave off with a bang. Still have only got one Pikachu. I know I I have to keep stressing this because this whole set is is around Pikachu, and I've got one. <laughs> so the pull rates for the for the Pikachu V Max, the Rainbow Pikachu uh, V Max, and then the Full Art Pikachu, the pull rates must be like outrageous. And I've heard they are. Drafrig, Alistair, Riolu, Eevee, C Dot, Electrike, Clefairy. Reverse Cottony and Alcremi. Creamy, Cremi. Still need our second amazing rare. Going by how pretty much everyone's boxes goes, you get you get two of them. Macargo, League Staff, Crocorock, Joltik, Sandile, C Dot, Picky Peck, Mudbray, Reverse Terrakian, and a Mudsdale. Yeah, so just like the left side, we've kind of hit like a dry, we've kind of hit like a dry spell in the, on the right side, you know? The left side start off like, because we got the Pikachu V and then it was just like dud after dud after dud after dud and then it kind of picked up towards the end. This one has, we, I mean, there's been some hits sprinkled in, but we've definitely hit a uh, dry patch here. So hopefully, I mean, these last couple packs that we have, we leave off with a bang. Electric, Kakuna. Loudred, Wooper, Ninkata, Wismer, Drillber, Whalmer, Reverse Galarian Stunfisk, and we got Metagross. This might be the first Metagross I've got, honestly, out of any of the boxes. I might have got it. I, I might have got one. I don't really remember. But I actually have a shiny Metagross in um, Sword and Shield. I found Matang, a shiny Matang in the Crown Tundra. So, I have a shiny Metagross. I actually really like Metagross. Honestly, I'm a big fan. So, I'm actually kind of happy to have that. Because I don't think, like I said, I don't think I've got it yet. 
Man, all these... Oh, so many green codes. I don't want to go, like, super crazy about it, but, I mean, dang. Sir Chester Bath. Hit him on top. Swoobat. Chatot. Clobopus. Skiddo. Shuppet. Ferroseed. Reverse Hollow Vaporeon. And we got Exeggutor. It's actually a really funny card in XY Evolutions. It's like uh, one of the secret rare ones, like uh, Imakun or no, that's Imakuni's Doduo. There's like a, there's like a funny looking uh, Exeggutor card in in uh, XY Evolutions that they kind of made for like, it was like a, I think it was a secret rare. Yeah, pretty sure it was. Just like Imakuni's Doduo, flying Pikachu, surfing Pikachu, and all that. That's what I just randomly thought of that for some reason, getting that Exeggutor there. All right, we got, oops, we got Metal Energy, Go Goat, Careless, Careless, Stone, Stone Energy, Chimeco. That's what I think of when I read that. Blitzel, Slugma. Maybe, maybe it's a play on that. Beldum, Milsery. Ooh, Zacian. We got the Zacian. I already have one of these, but I, I would, I would have loved to have the Zamazenta just to almost complete the Amazing Rare collection. But we have our next uh, Amazing Rare here, as you can see, Zacian. Coming in. So that's our second amazing rare here. And then we got the hollow Regirock to leave off that one. But this is obviously the main attraction with that pack. The amazing rare Zacian. Zacian, Zacian, whatever you want to say. My brother gives me crap for pronouncing it however I pronounce it. We're going to get that sleeved right up. Oh, that's so nice. So clean. All right. There we go. I was waiting. I was waiting for it. <laughs> Man, still no more Pikachus, though. I need a Pikachu. I need another Pikachu. Like, please. I, like, I want to see what the other Pikachus look like. I can see pictures of them on the internet, but I want to see what it looks like and, and just, you know, see it in person. Please. I just only have two Pikachu Vs, man. Nessa. Nuzleaf. Wash Energy. Drillbird. That's crazy. We got Water Energy, Nessa, Wash Energy, like, geez. Clefairy, Whalmer, Dynamo, Execute, Reverse Bea, and we got Barrascuta. Getting into the next pack. We're almost done here, actually. I think we have, like, four more. Yeah, we're almost done here. And it's looking kind of grim. <laughs> no, we haven't got any more Pikachus. Tinturchin, Telescopic Sight, Ferrothorn, Pinaco, Clefairy, Tynamo, Milsery, Galarian Meowth, Reverse Hollow Woobat, and we got Ampharos V. I have a couple of these already. I feel like Ampharos V, Colossal V, like those ones, like... Like, Ore Beetle, like, the, you get so many of them. It's like, if you get, like, multiple boxes, like, you're always, like, gonna get one of those, I feel like. It's just, which, I I mean, I really do like the art on the Ampharos V. Like, it's actually really nice. But, man, when it, and it just tease you with it, too, because you think it's gonna be, like, a Pikachu or something, and then it's not. <laughs> which, the the full art Pikachu is, uh, is, like, pink. It's, like, it's, like, really sweet, so... But still, like, you'd just be thinking it's a Pikachu. Honestly, like, how could you not? I think we have three more packs. Three more. And we leave it off with a bang. I don't know if we're going to get any more Amazing Rares because we already got two. But, I mean, I, I've saw people get three or four. Alistair, Cramorant, Banfi, Yanma, Galarian Meowth, Duskull, Weedle. Reverse Dusclops, and we got Graplock. All right, so we got two more packs. This is it. This is the moment of truth here is... I wouldn't say it's a complete dud. I mean, we did get that Rainbow Alistair. We've, we've got some good cards, but I mean, man, I'm just surprised how hard it is to get the other Pikachus. I really am. Like, I did not think it was going to be this difficult. I can understand for the Rainbow Pikachu, but I mean, geez, for even the Pikachu V Max or the the Full Art Pikachu, like, come on, 
Come on, give your boy something. We got electric energy. We got to speak it into existence. Swellow. League staff. Charmeleon. All the, the, the pressure here. Joltik. Attention. Weedle. Halo. Sandile. Probably not going to be anything. Come on. Who am I kidding? Oshawott. Reverse Oshawott. And we got Leon. We got Leon. Let's go. I will take that. I will take that. We got the Leon trainer card. That is nice. The full art Leon. I'm definitely happy about that. Obviously, would have loved the Pikachu, but let me read what it says. During this turn, your Pokemon's attacks do 30. Okay, so it's just like the other one. This is just the full art. So the rainbow one, I wonder if the rainbow one has a different ability. I was hearing that it does something crazy with like paired with Charizard, but maybe not. Maybe I heard wrong or saw wrong. So we got the full art Leon. Let me show it in the, the full art trainer for Leon. Let me show it with, this, with it in the sleeve. That's a nice card. That is a very nice card. You, who, who doesn't love Leon? Who doesn't Who doesn't like Leon? Like, come on now. All right. Last pack. Can we get some last pack magic? I'm going to say it's looking pretty uh, slim because we just got that Leon there, but you never know. You never know. We actually did leave off the left side on a bang. So let's see. Let us see here. Oh man, we got a white code, so we might, we, it's, a, it's a possibility, it is a possibility, more of a possibility. Alright, we got Fighting Energy, Duat, Opal, Matang, Riolu, Eevee, Seedot, Electric, Clefairy, Reverse Barothorn, and... Electrode, man. Electrode's having some trouble, isn't he? He's having a lot of trouble. Oh, okay, man. So for a recap of what we got in this booster box, we got the Full Art Trainer Leon, which is really nice. This is a really nice card. I really like this one. We got Ampharos V, Amazing Rare Zacian, Zacian, however you want to say it, or Beetle V Max, the Rainbow Secret Rare Alistair Trainer, which I really love this card. This one and the Leon, probably my two favorites, honestly, from this uh, opening. Orbital V, the Amazing Rare Rayquaza, which you always got to love. This is a beautiful card. Colossal VMAX, and Pikachu V. So, yeah, like I said, this is the only Pikachu I've got so far is this one right here. So, how many hits did we get out of this box? We got one, two, three, four, five, six... We got nine hits, which I think is actually the least amount of hits I've got in the box. So this in comparison, although we got the like probably the better pools, I didn't get as many hits uh, in this box compared to my other boxes because I got more hits in my other boxes, but they were like more V cards and more, you know, things like that. So um, overall, honestly, I'm just like, I know I keep saying it, but I, I, I really am mind blown with just how hard it is to pull these other Pikachus. You know, we got Pikachu V, but there's still three other Pikachu cards out there. There's Pikachu V Max, there's the Rainbow Secret Rare Pikachu V Max, and then there's the Pikachu V Full Art. We didn't get any of those. I haven't got one of those three in three of my boxes. The only Pikachu that I've got is Pikachu V, so it must be really hard to get one of those three cards, man. So if you have one of those, then consider yourself really lucky uh, that you got one of them. I know a lot of people probably have them right now, but consider yourself lucky because I've opened up three boxes and I have not got one of those yet. At least one of those three. So it's crazy. But Vivid Voltage, I, like I said before, I love the Amazing Rares. And there are a lot of other good cards in here. Like, I mean, that Alistair, that Leon, there's the Nessa, which I haven't got the Nessa yet. There's Bea. I mean, there's so many other good cards in here besides even the Pikachus like that I, I really, really love. So I think this is a really good set. Honestly, like from Sword and Shield... This is probably my favorite set, honestly, I, I would say. Like, I know people are going to be like, oh, but well, what about Champion's Path? Champion's Path, in my opinion, is like trash without the two Zards. Like, honestly, without the two Zards, like, would anybody be... It would be almost be like a Steam Siege. I don't know if it'd be as bad as Steam Siege. I don't think it'd be as bad as Steam Siege. But it, it might be pretty close. Like, it's kind of treading on, on, that, on that line, uh, like Steam Siege territory. But 
I, I mean, I would probably say this is my favorite set in, in Sword and Shield, but I mean, man, for the holiday season, it looks like they, they really are going to leave off with a bank because we have Shiny Star V coming, so the next set is going to be one to really look out for. And I'm not saying I'm done with Vivid Voltage because you may still see me open some more Vivid Voltage in the future, like if there's like a reprint, because I think they plan to have a reprint. That's probably when I'll buy another box or two. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll buy one to keep or you'll kind of hang on to and then one to open again in search of, of that Pikachu, uh, one of the Pikachus. I'll take one, one of the three at this point. Obviously, I'd love to have the rainbow one, but I'd take either you know, either one of them uh, of the three that we have not got yet. But, uh, you know, giving you guys more of a look um, of Vivid Voltage here with the booster box open, you can see more of the wide spectrum of kinds of cards you can get in comparison to my video I did for the Elite Trainer Box. There's only so much you can get or see. Uh, and that even with this too, because there's still so many other cards out there, but you get a good um, a good feel. You definitely get a good feel of the set. And like I told you guys, I really like this set. I think it's a fun set. I think it's probably the best set that honestly we we've had for Sword and Shield in terms of like diversity. Because you know, Champions Path, it was just like really the two Zards, and then everything else is kind of like meh, in my opinion. Darkness of Blaze, there's a lot of good pools in there, but I feel like this set has, especially with the Amazing Rares being incorporated, it has a lot more diversity, in my opinion. There's like there's a lot more there. Um, besides the Pikachus, there's other chase cards. There's some other really good cards in here. So, yeah. Uh, let me know what you guys think of Vivid Voltage. Let me know what you guys thought of this opening. Let me know what you think. Uh, your What was your favorite pool? What was your favorite pool that I had in this video? Mine is probably the, the Alistair, the Rainbow Secret Rare Alistair, I would have to say, with Leon, the full art Leon coming in close second uh, there. So, yeah, let me know what you guys' favorite pool is. What is your favorite card in Vivid Voltage, like I asked earlier, for either competitive or just from the look of the card? I'd love to know you guys' thoughts and hear you guys' thoughts in the comments below. I will see you all in my next Pokemon video, whatever one it may be. I hope you guys did enjoy this one. If you did, make sure you drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you for watching. Peace out.